one could summarize the, uh, the impact of the SSP by using the word neural platform. But what is a neural platform for? It's a neural platform for social behavior, but it's also a neural platform for the integration of other neural processes, uh, such as movement and listening, which is part of what ILS is about. But to think even on a deeper level, the SSP, by creating a physiological state, by creating the resource of that neural platform, is also creating a platform for, for we could say hypothetically, because we're not there measuring it with tools, hypothetically for neurogenesis, for neuroplasticity. Why can we make that statement? Because physiological state affects the accessibility to various parts of the brain. And we all know that because if you're in a meltdown or a tantrum, tell me how well your cognitive functions are. So we know that executive functions and certain cognitive functions are not accessible in certain physiological states. So SSP is creating that neural platform that hopefully will promote neuroplasticity and better coordination of movements with thoughts, movements, and feelings.